What's going on everybody? Just wanted to give you an update on the indoor aquaponics. It's been a while, so I uh, just thought I'd show you. As you can see, things are going great. Uh, over here I have a bunch of basil. Basil does really, really good in aquaponics. Um, these three are actually all cuttings I took off these larger ones here. And we just keep trimming it back and trimming it back and trimming it back and it's just non-stop. Over here I got some parsley. This is this, under my full spectrum LED. I have my flowering plants, my tomato, which is growing out in the back. And then in the front I have my peach habanero. Right now I got this habanero on it and that habanero. And it's starting to flower again. A whole bunch of little buds everywhere. Over here has been my experimentation area. Here I actually took a cutting off the habanero and tried to see what it would do. It's definitely not doing good, but actually there's a little tiny leaf starting right there. I didn't see that the other day. And I took another clipping and I put it back here and it's actually doing good. So we'll see what happens. Like I said, I, I'm just experimenting, seeing what goes good, what doesn't. Had some arugula over here. It's looking uh, pretty crappy. One thing I have learned is that with lettuces, because I've already harvested a couple batches, is I always start um, my lettuce in a different area, and then once it's about four inches tall, then I go ahead and transplant it. It does a lot better when it's a little bit more mature than just starting from seed here. Uh, this is a Carolina Reaper that I'm going to grow in here over the winter time and then transplant it outdoors uh, so I could get a good head start for next year. And as far as the tilapia, they're doing really good. I've turned the temperature down to try to slow their growth only because I'm trying to get another fish tank and I was hoping that I'd discover a, a mated pair and then I put those guys separately in another fish tank. This tank is actually pretty crowded. I want to say there's probably 20 white Nile and blue tilapia in here, along with a pleco wherever he is. I don't know where he is right now, but uh, they're good size. The biggest one is about four inches, I'd say. Old fat guy. But everything is doing really good. Really, really good. I'm very happy with it. Uh, like I said, it's not a big food production as far as herbs and tomatoes, even though, as you can see, we're gonna get a whole lot of tomatoes here shortly. But it's just a, a good experience all around, period, so. Here's the whole thing. I'm trying to get the light a little bit better. And that's it. If you have any questions, let me know. Put them in the comment section and uh, I'll get back with you.